Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Doing? Happy weekend. I hope you guys are enjoying your weekend, enjoying summer and all that good stuff. So like I promised in my last video, I said I was going to do another like glowy bronzed um, summer makeup look um, and more on like the simpler side. So this is what I came up with. Like super bronze. I don't know why, but I'm so, 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 so attracted to like bronzy like bronze summer glow um as of late mind you i have like super duper oily skin <sighs> so let's pray for me let's take a moment and pray and i get hot easily so i don't know how that's gonna work it does take time for sure because a lot of people feel like um because i said the simpler version it should take um less of time not really i still feel like natural look actually takes longer than um more like of a dramatic look main gist of it is still the same like similar steps as what we did in the last video i will link the link down below so you can check that out and hopefully you like it um this one is more so like on that dewy glow whereas the other one was more so like a little bit of a glow and bronze um but still keeping like certain areas mattified because i do have um oily skin so now what i would say is a if you have super oily skin I will let you know how this plays out um, in my next video, so watch out for that. Honestly, with my skin, I get oily a lot, like in my T-zone, so I took time to try to like mattify that area and not put a lot of like glowy stuff on there. The rest of my face, I feel like over throughout the day, it does stay very dewy and very... Anyways, I'm blabbing. <laughs> Um, let's jump right into this look. I hope you guys like it. Please, please, please subscribe to my channel. I'm really, really working hard every day to kind of improve my videos and like what I upload. So when I see when people are viewing it, when people are commenting, when people are liking it, it does give me that push. Like, you know what I mean? Like people are looking for you to get better. I appreciate all the support and the more the merrier. So if this is your first time or you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe and like the video. Okay, my loves, let's get started. Um, right now, I'm just moisturizing my face with my moisturizer. I'm going to put the name down below. And next, I'm going to go with the NARS Illuminator in Laguna. And I'm going to put that all over my face for that extra dimensional glow. And you can mix this with your foundation if you want. I just wanted to put it on my face. Next, I'm using the Becca Primer. And this is the mattifying primer I'm using on my T-zone because I do have oily skin. So I don't want to be looking greasy um, halfway through the day. So you can skip the step if you have um, dry skin. And this is the All Day Luminous Nars um, Foundation. I used this in my last video. It does have a matte luminosity. So I ended up putting more um, Laguna to mix it together to give it that glow since we're going for that glow life today. Again, if you have oily skin, make sure you prep your skin properly for this look. If you have drier to normal skin, go all out for it. You're here for this. <laughs> Anyways, um, next I use my beauty blender just to kind of buffer everything out and add a little bit more products to the sides where I need a little bit more product. And this is my MAC Pro Long Concealer in NW45. I'm using that to cover my terrible bags and around my lip area because they tend to be a little bit darker. And next I'm using my HD LA Girl Concealer and Fawn just to do a little bit of highlighting. Nothing too dramatic like the last video. So very lightly because we're going for that soft look. Um, and again down the middle of the nose, um, nose bridge, forehead, chin and cupid's bow. And that's pretty much it for the highlight. Next, I use my black opal setting powder ever so lightly to set everywhere that I put the concealer on the face. So that way it's not going to crease on you throughout the day. You want that dewy look, but at the same time you want to very lightly set your concealer because you don't want it to crease. And that's exactly what I did. And down the forehead, I'm down the bridge of the nose as well and all that whole stuff next i'm using the nars multiple stick in copacabana this is a very shimmery silver highlight um again with the multiple stick i did explain you can use it on your eyes your cheeks and your lips i used my beauty blender to blend it out because i find that blending out with my fingers tends to leave it looking a little bit blotchy so um beauty blender it is you can use your finger or a brush whatever that you want and if you don't have this you can use any silver looking pigment or eyeshadow and i'm adding more because we're here for the glow live girl go for it anyway i'm gonna blend it all out like as you can see add as much as you want or as little as you want all up to you and that's what we're doing 
and down the bridge of my nose ever so lightly again be very careful with this if you do have oily skin because you don't want to overdo it and start looking greasy that's not attractive so very lightly cupid's bow all that good stuff and I'm going to put it at the high arches of my eyebrows just to kind of bring attention and lift my face a little bit. Blend out everything with a beauty blender or your finger or a brush. And this is South Beach. Um, the same one that I, so not South Beach, Palm Beach. Same one I used in my video last, my last video. And I use this wherever I would contour just to kind of give it that extra glow. And as you can see in this video, or as you will see in this video, I didn't do any heavy dramatic contour like the last video because again, we're going for that softer um, bronzy look and glowy look, nothing too dramatic. On a regular day, I'll probably do a little bit more contour because my face is ever so very round that I do need that contour to restore shape. Okay, back to what we were doing. I had to jam out to that song. I'm using Black Opal um, Cream um, Foundation in Karab. I'm gonna put the name down below just to do a very light contour because you want a little bit of shape to your face, but not anything that looks chiseled. As you can see in my cheekbones, it, it is um, a little bit contoured, but like I said, not too dramatic. If I was doing this look on a regular for myself, for my own purpose, I'll probably go a little bit deeper because I have a very round face. I'm going with my e.l.f. bronzer in Kirk's and Turks and Caicos just to set the cream foundation so it doesn't move around throughout the day. As you can see, very subtle contour, very light, nothing too dramatic. So it's up to you, girl, because if I was doing this, I will go all out with the contour. Anyway, next I'm using this NARS eyeshadow in Mississippi Mermaid and I'm going to use it to set my Copacabana um, multiple stick. So this is very optional. If you are not using a multiple stick to begin with, you can just use your eyeshadow or a pigment and call it a day. Because whenever you put creams on your face, you always want to set it. Again, setting um, a multiple stick is very optional. It's all up to you. Anyways, I'm going all out. And next, I'm using my Orgasm Blush by NARS as well to go over the Mississippi Mermaid just to give it a little bit of color so it doesn't look too shimmery or too silver. And that's what I'm doing. It feels like I'm doing like a NARS tutorial because I'm using all, almost all NARS products here. Um, next, I'm using the NARS Dual Intensity Blush in Fervor. F-E-R-V-O-R, -R. I'm gonna put the name down below as well, is the newest blush in the company. And it's a very rosy, um, color I just buffered into my cheeks for that extra glow because we're here for the glow and this is um eyeshadow cream eyeshadow by NARS they discontinued it I'm using it as a base and this is Fez eyeshadow and I'm about to jam out right now give me 2.5 seconds Okay, back at it. <laughs> um, this is Fast Single Eyeshadow by NARS as well. It's a very bronzy, goldy look. And I said look, eyeshadow. And that's all I'm using on my lips just for that, again, extra glow, but not too much, as you can see. And this is the gel liner Night Flight, again by NARS. It does have a blue undertone. I was looking for my black one, couldn't find it. Long story short, I'm going to buffer this out with a black eyeshadow after I'm done applying it just to frame my eyes but not too dramatic nothing like winged liner like the last look or anything of some sort and this is me buffering it out with a black eyeshadow so it's up to you whatever you want to use black preferably couldn't find my black so you know you get the point and I'm using my essence um, white um, pencil liner and I'm putting that on my waterline. You can use a nude one, skin tone, whatever you call for. I usually don't like the nude one on my skin because it just doesn't show up. And I know that's the whole point. But I kind of want a little bit more to open up my eyes because the nude ones don't do much for me. Anyway, I'm using the Fez to buffer the um, under eye lash line. And I'm going to contour my nose ever so lightly with the same bronzer. Very lightly as you can see. Um, with an eyeshadow brush. So contour your nose whatever way you want. And this is the Ardell Lashes in Tool 5, same one as in my last video. Use some mascara to blend it in, as you can see. Um, and then some at the bottom lash, just to kind of define the bottom lash a little bit. And I'm using the Kenya Lip Liner. Um, this is like Cork by MAC, so you can use any brown or lip color lip liner. I'm gonna throw on some lipstick, and this is by e.l.f. Um, and it's called Party Buff. I'm gonna put the name down below. I'm gonna realize in a bit that I put way too much because I'm like, ugh, 
anyways I used um, tissue paper dabbed out um, a little bit and I put some Dior gloss um, over it and pretty much you're about to see the finished look in a little bit I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and see you in my next video love you guys Mwah. enjoy summer <laughs> the link I will link the <laughs> the glow is giving me so much life right now like hell of a good life <laughs>